you're here. Hello everyone. I was thinking about what kind of homework do we do or what do we practice and so on. So I've got a really good idea across my mind about recipe reviews. So in your last lesson, putting photos in a document. How can you put a photo in a really interesting way and make them collaged? Like collage is putting them overlapping each other, okay, sending backwards, sending forward, and then grouping them to make them one photo. So you can make more than one photo and turn it into one photo. See how can we do First that? First of all, you need to get a text about any recipe. I've got a text about a recipe review for gooey butter cake bars. So I went to the internet and I looked for recipe reviews and I got this recipe actually and I copied and pasted the text. I also took the pictures in here. I also took like a couple of, more than a couple of pictures actually. And I've put, saved them like this, right click, save as, and I saved them in one of my uh, folders which I prepared called recipe in the desktop. After I saved those photos, I took some of the text which I read from here and I pasted it into my Microsoft Office Word. So, I chose this text. Once you finish choosing it, you can just fix it and whatever, do whatever you want. Just keep the title like this, and then change the uh, font size, make it all the same. And then make them all uh, aerial or yes aerial is a good idea and then make them all like that and then make them all black and then underline and not underline you see i removed everything from here so now i think it we're ready place the cursor at the bottom in order to start adding the photos now in, in order to add the photos you need to go insert insert pictures and then choose the photos that you've done or you've got about the recipe and then start adding them now this is the main ones that i want this is the big one insert okay resize now after you resize all the photos Right click on the photo, go to wrap text and just check through. Okay, I checked through. Do the same for all the photos that you insert. Now you can click and drag text and place it wherever you want. I will add other photos as well. Make the photos of different sizes. Don't put them all the same size. And then choose them. Click on each one and choose wrap text. Then click on through. Same as for every other photo that you choose. And then click and drag to place it somewhere. Now, if in case you want to place one over the top and one not after the other, just like that. Okay, now if you want, just in any case, all right, this one is here, and I want to bring this one forward. Click on it and bring forward. It will be forward for the first one on top of this, but it's still not on top of this. If you want that, you bring forward. You can play with these buttons, bring forward or send backwards. All right, in order to move and reposition your uh, photos, as you can see. Once you're done, you have to click on the photos. Press the shift key and click on all the photos. Press the shift key on your keyboard and then click on all the photos. Then you click on this word group you're going to group them to make them one photo once they're grouped now look at me if i click and drag they are all act like as if they're one photo so
That's how you make a collage and that's how you group them. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Don't forget to do your homeworks on time.